Below in the deep there's adventure and danger, that's where you'll find Diver Dan. The sights that he sees are surprising and stranger than ever you'll see on the land. The Sergeant Major is a serious fish. To do his job is his only wish. While on duty, he'll never sleep, but patrols for danger in the deep. This doesn't look like trouble. Nothing in a manual about this. Better report this to the CO and on the double. Attention! About pace! Double time! What did he find that excited him? I don't know, but he uh, sure looked worried there. Uh, went by like a shark was after him. Trigger, my devoted friend. Go over there and see what Ruffle is scared. Uh, who, uh, me? But of course, who else could I send? Well, uh, like, uh, uh, let's think about it. Uh, uh, how about uh, you? Very well, you jellyfish. I'll lead the way from behind you. Well, that's great, boss. Sometimes, Trigger, I wonder why I even bother to keep you on as the trigger fish of the diabolical Baron Barracuda. The lead on, Baron Diabolical? Uh, say, boss, uh, is the exercise of following in front of you or am I getting hotter? You fool, you're not so hot heat from an underwater volcano. The uh, volcano? Well, I hate boiled fish, uh, especially when it's me. Uh, see you around, boss. Come back here, you spineless wonder. But Baron, the uh, guy can get hurt around a volcano. Exactly. Say, someone like Finley, or Diver Dan, or that stupid Sergeant Major. Hey, that sounds like good, dirty fun, boss. Uh, but how are we going to uh, arrange a barbecue over that pit? Very simple. You remember that old fish net we found? Yeah, boss. Uh, I have it stored in your filing cabinet under uh, net profits. Good. We will conceal ourselves nearby. You will hold one end, I'll hold the other. And when the first fish comes along, uh, we toss the net over him and pull him over the pit. Right, boss? I told you to call me Baron again and again and again. Okay, Baron, again and again and again. Uh, gee. Uh, it takes too long that way, Baron. Anyway, uh, how are we going to get any of those creeps to come over here? Don't worry about that. Unless I am mistaken. And of course, I never am. The Sergeant Major will return with someone to investigate. Why, he's probably reporting to the mermaid right now. Yes, Miss Minerva, it was one of my most interesting cases. Then I remember a time I had to treat a sardine for a bad case of claustrophobia. Claustrophobia? What's that? Claustrophobia is, uh, uh, an unreasonable fear of being confined in a small place. Well, that's not so unreasonable for a sardine, I must say. Hmm, perhaps not, but... Hop, trip, trip, four, hop, trip, trip, four, hop, trip, trip, four. Hello, Sergeant Major. A uh, moment, please, Mr. Niver. I haven't halted yet. Company, halt, hop, two. Sergeant Major requests permission to speak to the company commander. <laughs> At ease, Sergeant Major. 
He's so military. <laughs> Regular Marine Marine. <laughs> Miss Minerva, I've been patrolling around. I want to report a strange bubbling pit. A bubbling pit? What does it look like? Well, it appears to be a small mound on the ocean floor, but it keeps bubbling. It sounds sort of like this. Uh, bloop, 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 bloop. Ooh, Miss Minerva, do you know what this might mean? Whatever it is, it doesn't sound good. It has all the symptoms of an underwater volcano. And from the sergeant's description, I would say it's coming to life again. A volcano? Well, I'll be a yard bird if that doesn't sound bad. Oh, it's very bad. It could uh, cause enough heat around here to cook us all, Sergeant Major. Oh, I'd better diagnose the situation. Uh, will you take me to the bubbling pit right away? Ready to move off right now, Doc. Uh, will you be all right, Miss Minerva? Oh, yes, Sergeant, but, but you and Doc had better investigate further and report to me immediately. We may have to clear the danger area at once. Okay, all in. All in. Uh, hop to uh, I'm coming, Sergeant. It's a shame to have trouble in our ocean, but it's nice to have brave fish at times like this. And as the volcano continues to bubble, Dan and his friends get deeper in trouble. There's one other menace, don't forget. The Baron and Trigger have that old fish net. He moves among creatures of frightening features. Flashing teeth, slashing jaws, flapping fins, snapping claws. He protects and he saves his friends under the waves. That's where you'll find Diver Dan. 